Hello, what's up Madlang people? Today, I'm gonna be sharing to you uh, on how uh, to record your Casio uh, PXS1000. So you've got three options uh, if you want to record yourself playing uh, the digital piano, which is Casio PXS1000. Um, First is by simply using your phone or your tablet or an iPad. In my case, I'm using my iPad because it doesn't have uh, much in it, so it's got more memory. Um, so yeah, just by using your, your phone, iPad, or um, tablet, um, buy a decent um, stand, and then capture the sound as it comes out from the, the keyboards or the digital piano itself. Uh, that's the simplest way. Um, the only downside to that is background noise. Um, but if you do it um, during the quiet time in your house or close some of the windows and the doors, and it will sort uh, your sound. Because nowadays, phones, tablets, iPad, they got really good camera and very good microphone. So it can capture your sound uh, really good. Right, the second option is using the earphones um, out of the Casio um, PXS1000 but you have to have uh, certain accessories or cables with it. So this is my recording device, the uh, Behringer UCA222 and then you will be needing this one, um, stereo 3.2. 5 I think and then the RCA because you will be needing it for the input and then this one goes to your headphones out or earphones out from the Casio and then you need a converter uh, this one is for my iPad uh, to convert the uh, lightning to USB and then just the camera uh, of your iPad that will do that will record the sound and the video all together so this is the earphones out so you need, need this one and plug it in and this end you will plug the Behringer UCA so there it is and this end goes to the iPad. Okay. So the third option is this one. I bought this cable. Um, I think it's uh, one and a half meter. It's a stereo TRS or the one quarter inch to RCA because uh, the output at the back of the Casio uh, PXS1000 is a stereo out and then uh, I got this again so the RCA input goes to your Behringer UCA222 and then again the same this one goes to my iPad the lightning to USB converter uh, and this one goes to the back for the stereo out which is a lot better um, I find that the sound quality is let's say louder with this one than the earphones out because I think the earphones out they limit it because they're thinking you're using a headphone or earphone so it doesn't blow your ear um, but the sound quality, I think there's no difference because um, the Casio PXS1000 got surround and reverb but when you use this one, the earphones out or when you record using these options, I don't think uh, it's working and I think I've read it on the manual that it says when you're using the um, line out 
as well as headphones out it doesn't um, affect with the surround option um, but when you record um, the Casio directly from your phone or a tablet from the speakers itself then yeah it will capture the surround option so it's uh, depending on which one suits your needs with me this is my best option because I normally record in the night oh by the way the other thing if you use the line out the speaker is still on so I still plug this one in the earphone area so that it will mute the the sound so that it doesn't disturb anyone but yeah the recording is coming out here going to the ipad or i got an extra headset so i put it on the earphone out and that's my monitor and then it's being recorded through this uh, cable it's this one the trs for the one quarter need to plug it at the back one two and then this end the rca goes to the behringer uca222 there it is and then that end this one it goes to your ipad okay I hope that helps guys and thanks for watching. See you later.